Hi, welcome to my political show Behind the Scene. Today is the third episode of season one. It's the Polls Authority special. Before we start the show, I want to hit the like button, subscribe to my show. Now let's start. After the amendment has now been signed, the Sri Lankan government have decided to join forces with a group of companies from India and John Keels to sign 49% ownership of the East of East Wing of the port of Colombo, and I want the people to be the judge of that decision. Moving on from that topic, the government have decided Dr. Eliantha White to use different and different methods to control COVID-19 pandemic. And that one of the special methods have been so far known is special water, which is which is released in four different rivers with the help of four different ministers. And I want people with the judge of that decision as well. And moving on from that topic, the president has called a meeting on November first to 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 see how to control the COVID-19 pandemic. Now he wants to make sure that the people who are already quarantined will receive PCR. so a pcr so that they can go back to their normal lives this is a good sign that the president is trying to get people back into the normal life once again but however more good news on that department is the health ministry claims if if the curfew is extended for an extra week then the pandemic will be fully under control the president claims if we can control the pandemic in the first initial stage why can't we control the pandemic right now that is obvious isn't it now moving on from that topic dance jay sekar has reprinted the sri lankan flag flag which was previously printed in china our former governor tenno konis opposed this because of major errors in the flag after this after the circumstances dance jay sekar has apologized for the circumstances has apologized now moving on from that topic let's talk about pompeo he arrived in sri lanka but he did not meet prime minister mahindra rajapaksa or malcolm carnil ranjit this shows that while he wanted support from southeast asia he didn't meet the important people it shows that significantly this satnayak has announced he will not cross over from the sachit premadas's political party and he claims all of these things are rumors we will see in the foreseen future Moving on from that, Manu Ganeshan and major group of Tamil MPs are looking to get away from the document which releases them in the silver, and we will see that in the foreseen future how will that event plays out. Indeed, and sugar importers on the hand have been have 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 shown dislike towards the government on the low prices. The minister Bandula Gunwardena claims that himself nor the prime minister is in control of the prices. Obviously. Now, courtesy, cur- uh, courtesy for Maurada newspapers. Thank you for joining me on the show, and subscribe and like my show. Thank you very much.